announced my Pokemon Legends ZA, I decided to return to Hisui and play Shiny Bingo and Legends Arceus. However, due to the nature of Shiny hunting in this game, I designed the Bingo card a little differently than my last Shiny Bingo video. You'll see. All right, I'm going to generate the card. I'm terrified. Oh, wait, hold on. The card broke. All right, what do we have? You know, this is not bad. I feel like I can work with this. There's nothing absolutely terrible on this card. The shiny alpha is a little hard, but we might be able to get one. I don't know. Let's go to our first outbreak. Ooh, I say we go to the Kumi outbreak because I could then theoretically get a Hisuian Pokemon if I evolve into a Gudra. I feel like I have like kind of awful Legends luck, but you know, I believe I have a shiny charm now. Nothing can stop me. If you're curious, yes. It was a lot of grinding. Was it worth it? We'll find out in this video. We are here. I'm gonna use a stealth spray. You see nothing. Shoot. Okay. Well, that's not fantastic. Why are they all so far away? Please don't do that. Please and thank you. Oh my god. What are you doing in the tree? Okay. That was so far from the tree. It's not even hitting the tree. Okay, well, please get in the Pokeball. Please and thank you. These guys keep moving. They're moving and moving way too fast and they're getting on my nerves. Now they're in that patch. I come over here, they move to the other side. I don't think we're getting anything. Where even are the other Goomies? Hello, where are you? It says it's still here, but where? Okay, well, Goomy disappeared. Let's go back. On to the next outbreak. <gasps> I would like this Chansey, honestly. I really want a Chansey. We're going. I'll be honest, I always typically prefer to go to outbreaks over massive mass outbreaks. A, the odds are actually better in a mass outbreak. Also, massive mass outbreaks just stress me out. I have this like need to check every single outbreak in a massive mass outbreak. And so like something that was only supposed to take like 10 minutes will end up taking me like two hours because I will reload my save every time just to see if there's potentially a shiny in one of those massive mass outbreaks is that the healthy thing to do no absolutely not <laughs> i've been recording for 10 minutes okay we're saving we're saving we're saving hey little guy I want it in a jet ball. I love jet balls. <gasps> Do I actually get to mark anything? Yes, we get to mark a green shiny a and the Coronet Highlands. Oh my gosh. That's it. But that's not, listen, that's not bad. If I was really cheaty, I could evolve it and then make it a pink shiny. I won't do that. That's very cheaty. We go home now. <laughs> Let's look at our little guy. Oh, it's sitting. It's so cute. I love Chansey. This is my second sh shiny Chansey in this game, actually. And like, I really want a Blissey, but I think I'm going to keep this guy as a Chansey for now. I might evolve you later. We'll see. Let's go try to find another shiny now. Okay, I say we go to the Crimson Ireland's one. Pro tip, if you're running out of berries, save before you talk to May. Take a screenshot of what's on here. And then if you have to, you can always just reload. There's two starters on here. Here's the plan. I'm going to do a drive-by of every single outbreak. And then I'm going to check the Murkrow and the two starters here. And then I'm going to go. If I don't find anything, then it's not in the cards. But we might. Come on, go, go, speed. Drive by, drive by, drive by. Okay, my drive by was unsuccessful. I'm going to go backtrack now at this Murkrow outbreak and see if we can, like, maybe get a shiny pink burb. You see nothing. Don't be suspicious don't be suspicious you guys see nothing okay let's see about these guys ow hello oh no oh no okay okay ow time to reset and look for that grottle Hey, little guy. It's only been, for context, it's only been like 16 minutes since we found the, the, the chance. What? Well, 
We can mark a shiny Bidoof and a random shiny off. And a shiny in the Crimson Islands. And a yellow shiny. Oh my gosh, we have so many ways we can get bingo. This is absolute insanity. Well, I would still like to go check this grotto, but I'm happy. I am very happy. Oh no, they're all mad at me. Oh no. Yeah, I think it's chef all time. <gasps> what? shiny starter oh also i found an outbreak shiny i've now found like three um my bad this is going rather quick it has been 32 minutes <laughs> let's look at her guys oh they're so cute i cannot believe we found these guys so quickly well if we can find a pink shiny we're done an avalug i'm curious is there a shiny here can you imagine the insanity if we found another shiny Listen, you miss all the shots you don't take, so let's just go and see. And worst case scenario, we don't find a shiny. It's not pink. It doesn't actually help us get a bingo, but I mean, it could be fun. Hi, little guy. Please don't do that. Okay, let's like maybe fly away. I think that's a splendid idea. Man, I love truck balls. You could just sit over here and they can't see you. It's great. I'm having a great time. Obviously, part of the reason I am playing Legends right now is because of that recent announcement that Pokemon Legends CA is coming. And I mean, Sass, you play the clip of my reaction. What the is this though? Pokemon Legends! Ah! I am so excited i was so excited when it was announced i am still so excited pokemon legends rcs is probably my favorite pokemon game of all time even though i don't shiny hunt that often in this game there's so many things i can just find to do it, this game used to be the game if i had a bad day i would just play this game for hours and hours and i can get lost in this game i really love this game and I'm so glad to be playing this again. And I'm so excited that the next Legends game is it's it's happening. Like it's not this wasn't just a one off game. It's coming and it's coming next year. That is insane to me. One of the reasons I'm also so excited, not only is it a Legends game, it's also the game I have the most nostalgia for. I know this is a very unpopular opinion, but I actually love Kalos. I love Pokemon X and Y. It's probably one of the games I've played the most besides now Scarlet and Violet and then this. Ooh, wait, there's so many good options here. Okay, hear me out. I really, really want, this could be a pink shiny. Monkey could be a pink shiny. I also really want Sphelio. I say we do a drive-by, but man, when they announced Pokemon Legends in Kalos, I was so excited because Pokemon X and Y is the game I have the most nostalgia for. Some people would consider me a newer Pokemon player. I mean, I've been playing since Pokemon Black and White, but I really wasn't truly old enough to understand what was even happening until X and Y. And I remember just, I used to play that game so much. I actually loved the 3D graphics of the time. I love and adore the Pokemon of that gen. I loved the world. I love Lumioi City. Like, honestly, at first when I heard that it was potentially gonna be, the game was gonna only be in Lumioi City, I was a little disappointed, but honestly, I have a feeling that Game Freak's gonna cook. I'm really hoping they're gonna cook with this. I adore Lumioi City. This could be really good. I don't know. I'm curious to hear any of your thoughts. No shinies yet, but like, I can't complain. Beggars can't be choosers. Like, we have gotten so many shinies already, and it has not even been an hour into the recording session. Yeah, I have to take a break, so I'm gonna eat lunch on some chips. Okay, close the door. Thank you. Okay, we're back. This is actually like genuinely one of my dream shinies. We're definitely coming back for this. Okay, here's the plan. 
we're gonna go check out that magmar outbreak i could go for the a pumps because they are pink but here's the thing i have the entire a pom line shiny in this game i'll take them but i think i'm gonna go for another one i'd really like it if we could actually get a shiny magmar i adore magmar shiny i think it's beautiful i love all the pink i don't have one yet i would love to get one i will say one of my hopes for the next legends game i do hope that they improve the graphics for the next legends game some people in my community are like eh, i don't care about the graphics so much i'm like fair enough to them and honestly i will take gameplay over graphics any day but they are the number one grossing franchise in the like world i think they they could afford to make the graphics a little better right come on come on one of you shine one of you shine come on i believe one of you guys can shine oh no okay come on Okay, you didn't get in. Come on, get, get in, get in now. No, no, hide. Gosh dang it. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's go to the next world, shall we? Listen, we can't win them all. Usually I win none of them. I will not be impatient. Great things come in time. Honestly, I don't want this challenge to be over already. Like <laughs> we just hit the one hour mark of recording. And I'm having a really fun time. I love this game so much. This game makes me so giddy and happy and puts me at peace. I adore this game. I know I've said that so many times. I will never just stop saying how much I adore this game. I, I It truly is like one of the greatest games. Okay, well, I'm gonna go the Alabaster Isons. I don't even know if any of the Pokemon here can be pink. May, tell me what they are. Tell me what's here. What are we gonna hunt for? Okay, hear me out. I am going for this rufflet. So many people were begging me in my last video to turn Coco, my shiny rufflet, into a Hisuian braviary. And I was just like, no, absolutely not. Like, his name is Coco. Coco is Coco. Can you imagine, like, you've been told you're going to be a cup of hot chocolate and then all of a sudden everyone's like well actually i think beer tastes better so therefore can you please be beer i don't know where i'm going with this analogy this analogy is not working my point is coco is coco and i adore him we find another rufflet and they can become a history and braviary coco is baby bird forever though well i guess these rufflets are also going to stay as rufflets let's go check out the monkeys i know i said i wasn't gonna check out monkeys but like monkey clearly has something to show me let's go see those monkeys know what's happening they know and they're not appreciative honestly this is probably one of my favorite pokemon in this game i do love how the little guys just vibe with you i don't know do they get mad at me i don't know let's find out or do you guys just run away i actually don't remember it's been a while i think they just run get in the pokeballs please okay well no monkey today or for now eventually but not right now okay monkey <laughs> monkey wants to be caught it wants to be found i will go check this monkey outbreak watch us find another alpha i already have one on my main team i actually need to come up with a name for it a lot of these guys surprisingly don't have names i didn't really start nicknaming my pokemon until later on or until like scarlet and violet i should really give some of these guys nicknames though for some reason i decided i kind of like the name milkshake just now i don't know why can you tell that i am hungry or strawberry strawberry could be cute what am i doing this is not what we're <laughs> this is not what we're here for we're, we're, we're talking about these monkeys hi okay well they saw me unfortunately come on shiny shiny okay they're running very far away now please stop running please and thank you no gee when <laughs> i like a zoo bat or a zoo bat i actually would like neither but thanks came okay we're gonna see what's here Ooh. i want to check the rolls i also want to check the mag b here's the thing though if I get a shiny Magby and then I evolve it, does that count? Because from that logic, I could just go evolve my Chansey. But that's like not very fun. Oh. Well, they'll run, which is good. Run. Run. All of you, run. Fear me. You just threaten them with a Pokeball and they usually get the hint. Okay, that one didn't. Get out of here! 
Go! Come on, go. Oh, okay. You don't like me very much. Well, that's too bad. I don't really like you either. Get in the Pokeball. Uh, I have a feeling that there's no more. Well, let's go check for Magby's. Wait, hear me out. We could theoretically, we could find a shiny Magmar organically. We could find it. We could find a Magbar. There's some here. I don't think there are any shinies. Just in case there's a second horde, let's like get rid of these guys. <gasps> I'm so glad I checked. Come on, come on. One of you guys shine. It would be great. It would be fantastic. I'm sad. All right, on to the next. Well, see you later. I would like to find a pink shiny. Thinking of pink, what I really, 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 really want is a shiny Beniri. Honestly, we should be checking the Obsidian Fieldlands. There's a lot of pink shinies in this place. We could check the island with Chimchars, and we could also check where the Beniris are. Now, here's my question. Does Shiny Beniri and Lot Bunny count as a pink shiny? I say they do, but like, honestly, if we're actually being realistic, I don't know if that's actually like fair. I say they do because I think the fluff is like half of them, but I don't know. Usually I wouldn't say accent colors count as making that Pokemon like a specific color, but I feel like for Lot Bunny and Beniri, the pink fluff is such a huge accent that I think it's fair to count it. Listen, I dream of having this shiny Alpha Lot Bunny. I desperately want this shiny Alpha Lot Bunny and it's gonna continue to be a dream. Let's run in the forest. I think we will wish once more. Okay, I think that answers my question. No pink shinies, sad. It's okay, we leave and then we come back and that's fine. Ooh, okay, we're going to the Obsidian Fieldlands. There are a lot more opportunities for a pink Pokemon here than in the Alabaster Icelands. There's so many good options. Oh no, this is like one of those moments where I'm like, I actually would like to be here for like ever. My number one target right now is this guy. I don't have a shiny Chimchar. I desperately want one. I've wanted one for ages. Slightly off topic, but on topic. I am proud of me. Like I can actually, you know, check on a massive mass outbreak and then like only check a couple of the outbreaks and be okay with leaving. That used to not be the case. I would blame that on my OCD. That just goes to show that my OCD is getting a little better. Also, I, when I say OCD, like, I, I mean, I, I actually do have OCD. Like not like, a, oh, I, I like everything clean. That's actually not the case at all. Like, I'm actually quite a slob. My OCD more manifests in a lot of like repetitive behaviors, having to double check everything and per severe perfectionism. Like I used to have to check every single outbreak and now I can actually go here and leave. So kudos to me. My OCD is getting a little bit more under control, I guess. I say we go to the coastlands again. Shiny Magmar, is this our time? Is this is our time to we finally find the shiny magmar please i beg game please look on me in favor please have a shiny magmar i beg no shiny magmar but there's a monkey monkey continuously makes an appearance I, it's almost as if monkey like would really like to come home and you know what i can accept another shiny monkey i'm i'm we love we stand monkey here monkey is queen slay girl boss you know jet balls you're not an alpha but i'll take you <laughs> and with that bingo <laughs> i cannot believe this if you have bad shiny luck fyi the shiny charm is worth it 